Hello, my Pisces friends. Guiding Halo. Let's see what's coming in for you. Money, finance, career. This is mid-June. Uh, Reading for mid-June. Money, finance, career, mid-June. Whoa. We have four of wands, contentment, peace and abundance, a happy home life, a successful completion of a project, Aries. So someone could be buying a home, a decision from a boss, judge, CEO. We have a tower moment on the bottom of a thing. A, a tower moment on the bottom of a thing. I don't know why or that came from, but on the bottom of the deck. A significant life event, a powerful revelation that leads to change. Time to spread your wings. Time to spread your wings and fly. I wonder if someone wants to buy a new home, coming into a new home. Somebody could be getting married. Nonetheless, taking control of your life. Tell me about this Four of Wands. Oh, actually, before I do that. Yeah, tell me about the Four of Wands and what angels around guiding that scenario. Four of Wands. And you can look up this angel for yourself and see how it is and what it is they do. Archangel Gabrielle, Mallory, and Seraphiel. Collecting spirits. Oh, you have new... Oh, wow, the Ascended Masters are all over you. You have four fours here. Four, 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 four. Being led and guided by the Divine. That's beautiful. We also look up fours and what fours mean for you. Let's do that right now. Uh, let's see. Angel number... What does 4444 mean? The angel number is associated with difficulties. Your guardian angels are delivering you this figure to remind you that you may face problems, but they will be there to support you and guide you through these difficulties. All that stands in the way of your success is the assistance of angels. Now let's get another one because I feel there's more to that. Okay, you're, it's like you're in need of answers and circumstances and situations. There's like, this is a special message. Is there some sort of needing to put in the effort along with it? I'm gonna go back one and go to a site I'm aware of. Okay, here we go. Here we go, my friends. Let's see what's up. This is like Matt. This is like, uh, how do you say? This is um, very powerful because it's the, the number four manifested four times here. When angel number four consistently appears, it indicates that your angels are all around you and with you. The angels are offering you support and inner strength to enable you to get the necessary work done. They understand that you are toiling towards your goals and aspirations, and the angels ask that you call upon them for help, support, guidance, and the emotions of love and security. The repeating angel number sequence indicates that the angels are surrounding you at all times. Uh, let's see here. They're here to reassure you that their presence is going to help you move forward. They encourage you to continue working towards your goals. There, you are going to have success with this. If you're asking questions about that, you are definitely going to have success with what you're dealing with right now. Tell me about this. Four of Wands. Moving forward at a fast pace. Someone could be coming into a situation where you are moving. There's possibly, this could resonate between the 6th, 7th, and the 16th of June precisely for you because 4-4 four is a 16 and I have a 16 here in the tower. Movement forward, a vehicle, buying a vehicle. This is a moving forward towards a solid home, something you're going to want to celebrate for sure. It's a victory. Could have a victory regarding a Cancer or an Aries. Could be a judge that brings in or a boss CEO brings in a victory. Makes your home life incredibly happy. 
someone could be getting a loan for a vehicle. Nonetheless, it's acclamation, awards, contentment. Someone could be getting married that brings about this movement forward. It's going to be incredibly happy for you. Nonetheless, we have higher government coming in here as well to put their stamp of approval on the circumstance or situation. Perhaps that's what you're waiting for, is government passage. It's like the government is the doorkeeper to the situation. They make the decision, it brings in the happiness that you seek, the stability that you seek, and you move forward through the door. Wow, coming into absolute concert with the divine and with, with the forces on earth and with the forces in the spiritual world. An abs this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Some of you could be musicians who are actually involved in putting on some sort of concert or some sort of situation. There's a date with destiny showing up here for you. We have both the higher arcana of the whole deck, the male and the female. Highest arcana we have here are on board. Some it could be marrying an absolute counterpart where uh, someone is standing firm. Oh, you could be coming into concert with standing firm on what you were raised knowing as a child and your belief set and also including your intuition into that. It's coming into absolute concert with your gifts and abilities. But there's, there's some sort of lack of trust, I feel. Someone offering you something and you're like, I don't know if I want to go that way again, even though it's something that you wished for. Uh, I feel as though you feel it's the same, but it's not. It's coming to you with a different energy. Yeah. Celebration. Happiness. Joy. This is beautiful. Oh my goodness. My Pisces friends. It, it's almost like you fe wonder if you're lying to yourself, I feel like. You've been in hangman mode for so long. Could this ever happen for you? Well, it's all coming in a tower moment. It's a significant life event that's meant to be here. Hangman mode. Coming in to chop you out of the hangman tree, perhaps? This is Piscean energy. The problem with this is that you have a hard time making a decision moving forward. And you get a little bit stubborn with your intuition and your decision making, you see. And you get that way because it's understandable with who you are. Because you see both sides of the fence. You see the good that can happen and the bad that can happen. And a lot of times it's like in your nature to... To want to wander life alone and do things the way you want to do them. And I feel as though you're headed to a time where doing things alone is no longer going to be the way forward for you. It's no longer. I saw a card under here. Look at this. No, doing things away uh, by yourself is no longer the way forward. Holy crap. Coming into absolute concert, kindred partnership with another, whether in the work life or in any. This could be for any situation in your life because we have so much major arcana. We have the sun card crowning the reading. Great happiness, great joy. No wonder. Look at all the celebration, the movement, the creating of the balance. We have the wheel of fortune saying it's time. We have ingenious ideas. Somebody could be in a situation that they don't have all the answers to. Whereas maybe for a long time you've had all of the answers in your life or in circumstances and you've not had to really guess. You're new at this. Whatever this is, your soul's new. But boy, is it bringing you in some beauty. Clarity. Banish the fog of illusion. Open your eyes to the truth. Remember the perfection of who you are. Coming into absolute concert and union. You have seen and unseen allies. The fours, right? The angels. Seen and unseen allies draw upon their strength, join forces with friends and flourish. Anticipation. Something wonderful is happening. No shit. Changes in the air. Open yourself to blessings on their way. Beautiful energy. What's at the bottom of this deck, I wonder? Tower moment. Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow, the divine's coming in to bring you some beauty. Who did I tell you what? passionate opportunity i just saw the ace of wands tell me about this sun card clarity warmth beauty happiness coming into your true being the ace of cups brand new home brand new job brand new life brand new you it's going to take confidence to step into but you got this tell me about clarity making a decision banishing the fog of illusion and realizing that whatever it is you want you can have you have the world in the palm of your hand. It doesn't matter what you pick as long as you're passionate about it. As long as you love it. Union. 
an apology coming in. It could be about a, I feel it could be an apology or it could be the resurgence of love for life in your relationships. Resurgence of love of life, period. Tell me about the anticipation card here. Change, anticipating change. So there's things you have to go through in order to get through this and the divine bringing tower moments to bring this change towards you. Tell me about the movement forward, the victory and the left side of things. Victory, holy crap, victory upon movement, victory on top of victory. We have the Hierophant on top of these two people coming into concert with that. Some of y'all marrying with your soul purpose for the rest of your life or with another. Someone could be getting married and they're all up and they're happy about all this crap. <laughs> Wishes granted. It's a singular wish granted though. It's like a, you feel as though somehow you're alone in circumstance, but you're not. You're like being guided here in many ways. I feel as though good news about money's coming in, which brings in the Ten of Pentacles. You might have someone younger than you, or you are the younger person in this circumstance, whatever it is. Someone's children can be evolved in the circumstance, but there's new things that you're entering into that you don't have the answers to. You, you may need to learn more as you move forward. Tell me about this tower on the right. This is such a beautiful reading. An epiphany. Seeing the truth. Being able to clear away all that no longer serves you. Coming into a contract of some sort. The divine marrying you with the steps forward with the new moving forward. This is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I got my dick upside down. I want to feel I want to say I feel as though your lives are turning upside down and you know it you know it you already know it you know all this is coming down you know it is you feel it the change maybe you've been waiting for the change and it's going to be all kinds of prosperous your children on earth and in heaven are happy and well cared for by the angels you could be coming into marriage coming into having this you know you start taking control of your life and circumstances you're gonna maybe even some of you might be having a child or a, a baby birthing a new scenario into your life the divine wants you to know not to worry about your children regardless of where they are on this planet your desired outcome will occur in the very near future i'm telling you someone it's got something to do with someone's kids I got an angel, a happy family, happy changer additions coming to your family. You, maybe you wonder about how your other children are going to feel in this circumstance. Your desired outcome will occur in the very near future. Have patience and faith and don't try and force it to happen. So allow the divine to move things forward. Allow it to all come as it's supposed to. Because it's going to come as it's supposed to. The divine is in charge of all of this. Have you seen the major arcana in your reading? Holy crap is all I'm saying. Maybe that'll be the title of this reading. Holy crap. Because man. I love you guys. Blessings to you.